want you to bear in mind the need to emphasize self-discipline and leadership by good example. General Idi Agbon, born in Ilori in 1943, served as a right-hand man to General Muhammad Buhari during their military rule. His commitment to transparency and honesty and in respect even from those who did not directly know him. A group of admirers led by Paul Erine recently gathered at the Emir of Ilori's palace to celebrate Idiagon's life. Erine, the group's spokesperson, emphasized their deep appreciation for General Idiagon's character despite never having benefited from his rule. They hold him up as an emblem of the values Nigerians aspire to, which is transparency, discipline, and devotion to the nation. A joint Christian and Muslim prayer session offered solace and reflected the respect he commanded across religious lines. Beyond his military powers, Brigadier Diabo was known for his humility and compassion. He had a genuine concern for the well-being of his fellow citizens and worked tirelessly, tirelessly to uplift the nation, especially during challenging times. As we honor his memory today, let us not only remember Dundi Diabo for his accomplishments, but also for the values he embodied. Let us strive to emulate his courage, his integrity, and unwavering commitment to the betterment of society. The Emir of Ilori, Alaji Ibrahim Sulu Gambari, expressed his gratitude for the tribute to his late subject. He encouraged Nigerians to emulate General Ideagmo's pursuit of justice and his dedication to positive change. And I'm lucky to, to see down and witness how one of my students is uh, being appreciated, appreciated, even though he's dead. It's very unusual thing. And because it is unusual, God will we appeal to God to please accept his prayers, all the prayers we made for a dear one. The group's visit extended beyond words. They presented gifts to the Diagon family, including scholarships for five underprivileged students and a donation of rice to support those in need. This act exemplifies the spirit of service that General Idiagbon embodied. Babatunde Idiagbon, a man of discipline, a, a man of honor. He had very good things for Nigeria, but somehow it never came true. He used to say that a nation without discipline is bound to fail. We don't have discipline today, where are we? I have to honor the general. Those who don't care is their business. It is my lifestyle. I believe in sincerity of purpose. And he was a great man. And I put his name in my name and my answer to him too. Family members moved by the gesture reminisced about General Diagon's unwavering principles and expressed their longing for a return to those values in the Nigerian society. He has human relationship. He's always ready to give. Very human, very responsible, very respectful. He takes care of everyone, both in the house and our neighbors. He even asks you, what of your sisters, your brothers? He will continue to ask of you, your welfare, your health. So you see, I cannot quantify what I miss from him. General Idiagon's life continues to be a source of inspiration for many Nigerians who yearn for a return to a time of strong leadership and unwavering integrity.